Australian manufacturing industry is on the edge of a new industrial revolution with game-changing additive manufacturing technologies reaching its shore. Over 600 people from a variety of manufacturing and research organisations attended the Factory of the Future Roadshow, first of its kind held on the last week of June in Melbourne, Adelaide, Sydney and Brisbane. The conference was facilitated by Fermero CEO Simon Marriott. The Factory of the Future Roadshow featured Terry Wallers, a world-renowned expert on emerging manufacturing technologies as a key speaker. Mr Wallers arrived down under all the way from Colorado, USA. He spoke about the current and future role of additive manufacturing in the production of products that are difficult, impossible or too expensive to produce any other way. I don't know about you, but every morning I get up and I'm excited because there's something going on that's new and different, almost, if not daily, weekly. A new announcement, a new material, a new application, a new industry, just something going on all the time. It never gets old, never. It's been fun to watch the additive manufacturing industry grow from a very small industry that uh, was really focused on making models and prototypes quickly to where it is today, where we're seeing medical implants put into human beings. We're seeing uh, parts on military and commercial aircraft. There's parts in space on the International Space Station, the entire fleet of the space shuttle. Uh, it's exciting to watch the consumer products part of it grow as well, where now individuals are purchasing jewelry, uh, home accessories, office type products, and the list goes on and on. Stefan Ritt from MTT Technologies in Germany presented a new emerging additive manufacturing technology that enables the production of metal parts from 3D CAD data in a layer building process without limits in design and a remarkable speed and accuracy. Case Study Automotive, they had the first uh, SLM machine in 2006. They had the second one in 2009. They're using the machine every day for two to three parts at least. Dental. We perfectly agree with Terry's statement. Very much growing market. This is what, what all the dental offices give us and the competitors to say, you know, give me a bracket of 14 and make it very accurate and then I might think about buying the machine. We took the challenge and you see here, this is the 3D analysis. Actually, this is for Korean company. All the green stuff is within five hundredths of a mil accuracy and customer was happy with that. Dr. Mahez Jahidi from CSIRO Cold Sprays Laboratory spoke about a new direct manufacturing technology developed and patented by CSIRO utilising cold spray. The Factory of the Future Roadshow was sponsored by Vermeero, Department of Innovation, Industry and Regional Development, Amtil and the Lynx Project, CSIRO, Enterprise Connect, XYZ Innovation, QMI Solutions and the regional governments of Queensland, Victoria and South Australia. <laughs>